All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms, and data structures beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 75. All right. So now that we're updating the gold and health variables, we need those, pardon me, we need to display those new values on the game screen. All right. So they're talking about right here and right here. So after our assignment lines, we're going to assign the inner text property of gold text to be the variable gold. And we're going to use the same pattern to update health text with the health variable. All right. So here's an example. We'll let value equal 100. And then we'll have const total equals document dot query selector, uh, the total ID. And then we'll say total dot inner text equals value. All right. So we already have this going on right here. Uh, up here in these two places where we have uh, health text and gold text like that. So let's uh, select both of these by double clicking the health text and then also doing the alt, hold down alt and double click gold text. Oh, that's not how it is. How, double click the health text, double click the gold text like this. And then we'll press copy, right? And then we're gonna come back down here and finish up reading since we're uh, not done yet. And so we can test this by clicking our go to store button followed by our buy health button. And our note is that we should answer, pardon me, we, our answer, pardon me, should only be two lines of code. All right, so now that we've copied that, what we'll do is we'll come down here to line uh, 74. We'll paste it like this. Let's move gold text over one. And then we'll press uh, dot, we'll say dot inner text, like that, equals, with a space. And then we'll just select all this, copy it, We'll drop it off where gold text is. And then we'll say uh, add health text dot inner text. We'll say health with the semicolon. And then we'll do gold on the next line with a semicolon as well. Right. So when we go to store and we buy the health, we can see it goes up by 10 and down by 40. If we keep hitting it. It doesn't have any stops and we're going to have to deal with that later. But at least it looks like that for now. So let's check the code. Looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 76, and we'll see you next time.